three, two, one. Here we go! In essence, the most important thing about any boot, if you want it to stay on your foot, because when you hike and you straight toe hike, what you don't want to do is you don't want the boot to stretch at this part of the boot here. If it stretches at this part of the boot, then effectively your heel comes out of the boot. Because when you're hiking, you really need to be able to point toe hike. Because point toe hike straightens your leg. If you have to hold your foot in the air, it shortens your hamstrings and your knee bends. So that's kind of that's the reason why you need a boot that actively pushes your your you know your heel into the back of the boot, which is why the low cut boot or a pro lace boot is particularly good. The pro lace boot holds the heel in, a little bit of extra su support. You don't really need it, the strap, but it's all basically the heels held in the boot with the, with the laces. The all purpose boot, we've changed the fabric here to be less stretchy, and we've opened the zip up longer and at a bit of angle to get, allow you to get them on nice and easy. But effectively, this low stretch gives you the same sort of support you get from a real professional hiking boot, but it's the all purpose boot, easy to put on. And to com combine, to combine the, you know, the straight toe hiking, the, the trouble with the straight toe hiking is most toe straps, you just feel like you're rolling off the other side of the, of the toe strap. But when, you're, when you've got a, a really, really good, and I ask you to check this out, and you've got a really good high coefficient of friction rubber, and they're hard to find, and I can promise you they take a long time to find, you can virtually straight toe hike and you won't fall off the boot. In fact, it's really hard to move your foot across this boot. It's pretty locked in. We even found that the rubber was so strong that we had to change the rubber and add extra gauze in it to give it some more strength. And we've had to use an Amara thread in it as well. So it really has super strong thread, super strong rubber that's got a super high coefficient of friction, which fits brilliantly with your boots. Although you can move if you need to, because it's not like a Velcro. But when you're hiking, it's, it's, it's so comfortable. And you can, I'm literally pointing my toes at the floor and it won't fall off my foot. It's really effective hiking position with pointed toes. So I could be one-legged. With both boots. Okay. Actually, no. I saw my toe go up. I shouldn't do that. Throw forward. Okay. I particularly like the low cut boot in boats like a 300 or a Europe where I want a little dainty foot and I need to slip it in some places or I want some bit more support, a bit more stickiness downwind. But it still offers the same effective hiking because the strap is pushing your heel into the back of the boot. When weight's not an issue and you want to hike forever, then the pro lace boot is your answer. And of course, if you just want ease of comfort of putting them on, then your all-purpose boot. Easy to put on, but we've still thought about it, so we've still made it comfortable to hike. There you go. Enjoy your sailing, enjoy your hiking, and uh, get more tips at Rooster. <laughs>